The second homologous series for the hydrocarbon family is the alkenes. The alkenes have the general formula CnH2n. The first member of the alkene family is ethene. It has a functional group of a double bond between two carbon atoms and that gives the special properties, especially the chemical properties to the alkenes. Ethene has two carbon atoms and if you put in the general formula, you will get the formula for ethene as C2H4. The second member of the series is propene with three carbon atoms and the presence of a double bond between two carbon atoms. If you put the number of carbon atoms in the formula, you will get the formula for propene as C3H6. The third member in the series is butene. Butene has four carbon atoms, so the formula for butene will be C4H8. It has a double bond between the first two carbon atoms. Now this double bond can be present between the second and the third carbon atom also. So then it becomes a different isomer for butene. In pentene, the next hydrocarbon, we have five carbon atoms. So the general formula, if you substitute the carbon atoms in it, you will get the formula for pentene as C5H10. The double bond can be present between the first two carbon atoms or the second and the third carbon atom or it can be present between the third and the fourth carbon atom. So that's the homologous series of alkenes with the general formula CnH2n. The functional group present is the carbon-carbon double bond and this gives the characteristic chemical properties for this class of compounds. The gradation in the physical properties, example melting point, boiling point will be increasing as the number of carbon atoms is increasing in the chains. The density of the compounds will also increase with increasing the number of carbon atoms. You will find that the difference between each successive member in the series is the addition of a CH2 group as you saw in the case of alkenes.